hi class <laughs> and feels weird I've, i don't think i've uh, i've never taught anything maine kabhi kuch padhaya nahi hai so really if this goes badly it's on you to dekho i i i don't have any i've never taught so i don't really know exactly what what to say to you guys so i would let you guys take the lead and tell me what would you like to know from me i'm happy to share whatever it is that i've learned over the years i'm happy to share it with you guys so let's just jump into that so you see that marketing has changed uh, over the last 5 6 years a lot mm. uh, what are the uh, good legacy brands that you think have adapted to these new techniques and have you know come up with new techniques in order to you know market their brands yaar a lot has changed in the last decade i would say ever since hyper connectivity happened right because your our attention spans have become lower um there there's, there's actually a few things that have that have changed let's just let's just look at that first one the modes of distribution have gotten decentralized theek hai to ek time pe there were just a few ways to communicate with the masses in general right there were like 10 20 players in the in the market who would control most of the communication to so, tumhare tv channel pe itne hi channels the होर्डिंग्स इतने ही कंपनीज चलाते थे न्यूज पेपर्स प्रिंट मीडिया इतने इतने ही कंपनीज थे तो वो एक तो डिसरप्ट हो गया नाउ एनी बॉडी कैन बी अ पब्लिशर थैंक्स टू सोशल मीडिया इन्फॉर्मेशन इज गॉट डिसमिनेटेड सो दिस इज द वन मेजर चेंज सेकेंड वॉट कम्पीट फॉर अटेंशन हैज चेंज ड्रामेटिकली अर्लियर अर्लियर यू देवर फ्यूअर मोड्स ऑफ एंटरटेनमेंट वेर एज नाउ एवरीथिंग इज एंटरटेनमेंट राइट तो एक डोपमिन थ्रेश होता है हमारे दिमाग में कि क्या पढ़ने से हमको कितना डोपिन मिलता है वो अभी डोपिन थ्रेश इतना हाई हो गया है कि जो जो चीज हमें दस साल पहले इंटरेस्टिंग लगती थी वो अभी इंटरेस्टिंग नहीं है ये कॉमेडी में भी ये सच है राइट लाइक टेन इयर्स अगो मेकिंग हम नहीं पंजाबी सर इन द हाउस है यार तुम तो बड़े यू नो पटियाला पैक और ये वो वो अब अब उस पर अब उस पर उतना लाभ नहीं आता है क्योंकि हमारी डोपिन थ्रेश बढ़ गई है कि ये फ्रेश ये फ्रेश नहीं रहा सो बिकॉज ऑफ दिस it's become harder to it's become harder to build brands because you have to have more bulls eyes in order for you to start getting recognized right um so you need to you need to be consistently good over a period of time this is the mistake that a lot of people make jab meko koi brief aati hai to aksar brief mein likha hota hai ki tanmay hame viral ad banana hai right wo lag ye hamare haathon mein nahi hota ye ki kya viral hoga kya nahi hoga If you want to build a solid brand now, you have to be consistently good for many years. So there are few brands that have stood out naturally who've been who've been good consistently. You guys will obviously know them. In fact, we're a we're a large enough sample size for us only to to be able to guess. Like some one of the brands that I really like is I think Zomato has done a killer job over the last ten years. Uh, but if there's one thing that stands out from Zomato, we'll all have a different answer, right? Is there something from Zomato that you've liked over the last ten years? Tell me one thing. Minimal. Minimalism. What else? Like, a quick creative. Nobody has one particular. One ki ye nahi hai. Sabko alag 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 pasand aate hai ki us time pe unhone ye banana tha, is time pe ye banana tha. What does that indicate to you? That it's just they've just been doing, they've just been taking more shots and more of them land on land on point, and that's why over a period of time, um, you you start liking it. And this 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 fundamental principle of brand building hasn't changed over the years, right? Um, what builds like one of the things that builds a strong brand is hey there is a particular quality about you and if you consistently deliver on it like zomato has been minimalist consistently jo type ke holdings 10 saal pehle banate the wo same abhi tak banate hain right right sharukh khan romantic hero tha to sharukh ki romantic picture aayegi to tumko laga ki ye on brand hai ye to mujhe dikh rahi hai so that's that's actually still one of the keys of advertising which is you 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 pick you pick a brand style and you're you're consistent to it so that i think has become super key the second one is of course um ek me the term i use is refresh rate right which is things get boring a lot quicker so you have to you have to hit refresh so the the challenge is to stay true to brand while also reinventing yourself in uh, like that that is hard so you need to define your broad playing area a lot more uh, earlier on i mean but If you're a new brand, you can explore a little bit. You can see what works for you, and over a period of time, you can you can decide that. So these are the last like these are the last major changes I think in the in the last ten years or so. It stands for both uh, corporate brands and individual brands as well. Uh, those are the folks that usually usually succeed. 
बाकी कुछ नहीं फंडामेंटल तो सेम ही होते हैं अलग होना होता है यू नो यू नीड टू यू नीड टू बी लाइकेबल यू नीड टू बी कंसिस्टेंट दीज आर दीज आर थिंग्स दैट दैट प्ले अनदर मेजर थिंग दैट हैज चेंज इज दैट आई थिंक द लाइंस बिटवीन प्रोडक्ट एंड मार्केटिंग हैव स्टार्टेड ब्लरिंग अ लिटिल बिट राइट लाइक दैट्स इट्स नो लॉन्गर द केस दैट तुम अच्छा ऐड चला दो और उसी से होगा इफ द प्रोडक्ट डजंट रिफ्लेक्ट इट देन इट इट वोंट इट वोंट क्वाइट वर्क व्हाट आर द अदर ब्रांड्स दैट यू गाइस हैव लाइक इन द लास्ट डेकेड और सो Boat, Boat. What do you like about them? Like the design, it's quite nostalgic, and it has those animations, so it's really good to see. It's colorful. Yeah, it's colorful. Hmm. D brand, which is a phone case brand. D brand. Yeah. From the US. You, हम हमारी बात करते हैं ना. What do you like about them? They're very, uh, they're unabashedly themselves, and they're very. They're basically very rude on social media. They're rude. <laughs> So it, it comes out as funny. Then on the Wendy's side, got it. Why is the why does that why is that interesting? Because they're rude on social media. Because it's so uh, very refreshing to see a brand. Being exactly, like, exactly right. Because they're different from what they usually do, and what other other folks usually do. So when there is a this is one of the okay. Let's let's start from the basics. Okay. So I was just doing some quick research last night. Okay, about a thousand ads are made. Thousand video films are made a year, right? Someone put out a blog post. They they went through all the major films that were released last year. About a thousand. How many will you actually remember? You'll actually end up remembering less less than ten. If you know ten, means you work in advertising. Otherwise, you <laughs> right? You you know you know less than ten, right? So the hit rate is super duper low. Um, so our aim is to make something that shows up in this. Right, that to me is a win. If if you show up here, मतलब entrance exam clear होगी भाई. <laughs> right, that that is a win. Um, so in order to show up here, you have to you have to make something that does one of these two things. One is to create some form of engagement. अगर कोई कोई video आप बनाते हो, तो उसपे engagement से दिखता है कि ये कितने लोगों ने like किया है, comment किया है, uh, you know how many people have engaged with the content. And the other one, which is the sweet spot, which is the bullseye, which is if you get someone to share. Right. If you get someone to share, that is one to many distribution. If I have shared, then my 500, 1000, 1000, depending on how popular you are, that those many people will end up watching it. So these these two are the sweet spots. If you can get either two, the first one, if you engage with something, then the algorithm does the job of pushing it further. But if you get something, if you get someone to share, that's like that's that's the ideal spot that you want to be. Now, why does someone share? Why does someone share something? Relatability, relatability, but even more fundamentally. You want to uh, cool in front of the brand or just stand out. So you want to you want to stand out. Why? Yeah, we're in the zone. What else? Why else? Why else do people share? Personal validation. They are with the tribe. They are with the group. Last they are with the they they are with the tribe. That's interesting. Um. So when you what's your name? Anami. Huh? Anami. Anami. Yeah. Oh, you're French. I didn't know that. <laughs> and i'm with the e graph or okay. <laughs> so when you share when you put something on your profile what's actually happening in your brain is that you are building a catalog of things you've shared on your profile so what you're really doing is you're building your own brand yeah. when you share right it's actually not so much about the content it's about who you are the internet is a bizarre place we we share relatable content in order to stand out Is, which is <laughs> kind of a paradox, right? So what's really happening is that you're you're trying to build, you're trying to signal that hey, this is this is who I am. In the many years of uh, making stuff, some very clear signs have emerged of hey, here are the type of things that people tend to people tend to share, right? This is of course not a not a definitive list. Uh, these are just this is just I'm just putting it out there so you it can get you guys thinking. So for example i have observed that topical stuff is an easy bait to get people to share right if something is topical agar iski hawa chal rahi hai then you then you kind of want to share that uh, what's the latest right like kohli hit a century yesterday everyone wants to have a hot take on what what happened there so i also put out kal maine ek tweet maar diya i was like topical hai kohli ne century maar diya hai तो मैंने मार दिया कि ओ आई स्टॉप वाचिंग द वर्ल्ड कप आई स्टॉप वाचिंग क्रिकेट आफ्टर धोनी वन द वर्ल्ड कप 
is the old i stopped watching odis after kohli hit a century i mean it takes take mar diya ki abhi kohli ne agar sachin ka record break kar diya mera ho gaya bhai odi ke sath abhi band kar do pack kar do time ho gaya odi ko goodbye bolne ka uh it is it it is it well on twitter not cuz what i said was amazing it's just topical it's the shit that'll get shared right now so if you if you if you have a take on something that everybody else is talking about um you are offloading the work you are offloading the cognitive load of someone else to have their own take right yes right what you are essentially doing is tu soch mat maine bana maine tera opinion maine bana liya iske upar tu yahi share kar de right like mai mai i'm doing making your job easier for you so something topical always works people love people love a hot take on something that's currently the trend what else do people share cute stuff puppies this that yeah why why are they sharing that spread positive to spread positivity right so people love sharing anything that's like hyper positive right it's just it's just a break from the sadness that is the rest of the world right so hyper positive is something that always works i remember uh, at aib social media team i used to tell them when in doubt just be happy <laughs> when in doubt bas cute ban jao yeah are yaar just here to put a smile on your face yaar cuz the rest of the rest of your lives are so in- uninteresting and this thing you just want to engage or you just want to share and spread some positivity similarly nostalgia works <laughs> nostalgia works really well right cuz uh, cuz hamare zamane mein uh, was is always nice <laughs> right it just triggers a part of your brain that just always makes you makes you happy um extreme opinions in other, is another is another tool right when you have a very strong definitive take on something right people love it when someone has a spine when someone gets to call out something like aib's brand of humor was very call outy aib's brand of humor was very calling out bullshit so people love that that's an extreme take on something so we have an extreme take on something what happens you automatically create a market for the contrarian take to that take yeah. right so uh, like oh um, game of thrones ka last season kharab tha kharab tha i remember i remember this actually happened uh, the last season of game of thrones was trashed so heavily that i was like ki do hafta rukte iske counter opinion pieces shuru ho jayenge right everyone universally hated it and then slowly at some point i saw huffington post or some article that came out saying it wasn't that bad actually <laughs> right this is like you said uh, people just want to feel like they're part of a tribe they just, they just want to feel that um so especially on like instagram posts and so- social media like this is ye daily dal chawal hai unka ki everybody wants to have one extreme take on this thing on twitter pe to wo here's why i think <laughs> artificial intelligence is bad for you a thread right people are engagement farming no fully knowing ki if you have if you have a strong take on something uh that will get traction and the contrary is also true which is if you have a strong take against the popular notion so this broad framework can be applied to everything right like you said that brand of yours um which is which is rude on social which is basically saying ki oh everybody else is this way i will be this so this broad framework can be applied to everything ki baaki duniya kya kar rahi hai hum but obviously will do the opposite thing uh this kind of helps what else what else do people share उसपे तो पूरा ही लाइक मेरे चैनल पे पाकिस्तानी लाइक पाकिस्तानी बहुत सैवेज होते हैं यार तो जो भी पाकिस्तानी उनको लगता है हाँ यार मैं तो हूं यार जानता नहीं है पर मैं सैवेज तो हूं क्लिक राइट सो आइडेंटिटी बेस्ड ऑफ जनरली इज अज अ नो ब्रेनर एवरीबडी वॉन्ट्स टू से इट यू नो एवरीबडी वॉन्ट्स टू बी टोल्ड दी आइडेंटिटी दैट दे हैव चोजन इज यू नो दे दे वॉन्ट कंज्यूम कॉन्टेंट अबाउट द टेन थिंग्स ओनली गुजराती विल अंडरस्टैंड और गुजराती और लाइक हाँ यार ये तो सिर्फ मुझे ही समझ में आता है यार और किसी को आता ही नहीं है या आई थिंक इन कंट्रीज वेयर इंडिविजुअलिज्म इज यूजुअली पुश्ड डाउन दिस सॉर्ट ऑफ स्टफ डज सुपर वेल एंड एनिटी बेस्ड ऑफ सो दिस इज लाइक अनदर इजी 
it's an easy no brainer if you do something anything to do with identity especially if it's identity plus positive that kind of stuff um it really works gossip and sensation things also work very well anything that breaks the every day yeah we broad framework here is the sensation is nothing but extreme take on on something right is i'm 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 talking about super macro takes on things i'm being i'm being very broad is kind of if you go i'm bold for emotional and soft stories emotional and emotional stuff also works usually positive emotional stuff um positive emotional stuff kind of kind of works someone said relatability like relatability is super interesting because there's a couple of layers to relatability um one i used to call sh- gifting an emotion or sh- shared emotion like if you make something about you know flat mates right or oh, it it'll appeal to everybody who's ever had a flat mate if anybody who has lived on campus or shared a room with someone anybody who's left their city to go to another city to live to and has a, has a flat mate Im- any immigrants etc immigrants is another identity based thing and then there is like personal relatability right you know 10 things only tall guys will understand all tall guys are like this is just for me um so relatability is also also fairly broad um but you want to you if you want to make something you want to pick you want to pick a, if if you're going to do something you want to pick a niche that's not that occupied with the competition uh isn't that occupied i remember when we made the cred campaigns the first one right we got bappi lehri and we got like anil kapoor and all that where the idea was ki okay we cast udit narayan and alka yagnik in the ads we were like okay this just right off the bat these are people you wouldn't cast in a in a mainstream ad during the ipl during the ipl where you have ranbir singh and every like all the all the more contemporary stars on right? it'll be interesting to put udit narayan on screen there also cuz you know cred card holders are all older and you know the millennials these are folks that they would resonate with so just off the bat we were like ye alag this this would just be interesting then within that we said ki okay usually we usually movie stars are doing their thing and they sell the products like we'll we'll reject it right this worked for the brand really well cuz cred was positioning was supposed to be that so we reject kar lete तो ये ब्रॉड फ्रेमवर्क से हमने अप्रोच किया था कि ये इसके अंदर एक्चुअल न्यूआंस क्या होगा वो सब में हम पहले घुसते पर इसमें फीलिंग अच्छी आ रही है उनको रिजेक्ट कर लेते हम पहले से आई विल रिजेक्ट दिस यस्टरडे योर स्टार्स अम लेट्स गेट नाउ लेट्स कम टू ऐड राइटिंग ओके सो आई जस्ट वांटेड टू नो इज देयर अ सेट फार्मूला टू क्रिएट अ वायरल कैंपेन और इज देयर अ न्यू प्रोसेस एवरी टाइम फार्मूला होता तो सब कुछ वायरल नहीं होता हर बार सेट फार्मूला तो नहीं है बट देयर सम बेसिक्स um there's some basics that at least this this is the stuff that works for me um i would just want to put a disclaimer that this works for me and i'm not a conventional advertising person either i would make content uh and then i just started writing ads a couple couple of years ago um so most of my principles come from i like to approach it as i'm first making interesting content advertising comes second um so some stuff that i've written down one is look if someone is going to spend a lot of money buying inventory on on television or on ott um you have to respect that this stuff costs money okay kyunki often as creatives na hum excitement mein likh dete do page ka ad likh dete jo 1 minute chalta hai right which means inventory to 20 20 30 second ke kafi paise lagte hai to agar aap 1 minute ka ad likhte ho to aadhe aadhe time hi chalega basically eating into 50% of someone's inventory right which means you're automatically reducing the number of people you can directly reach out to so tumhara time hi kam ho raha hai usme so you got to respect you got to respect the budgets that are on this thing so tumhare paas hote 30 second 30 second or under to 15 15 second ka bhi edit bhi mang rahe log right so you just have 30 seconds like this is sacrosanct uh, my writers have a tendency to overwrite and my job is always to be like ki 30 seconds and under so 30 seconds to so kitna hi time hota hai in that it's you just have to stand out from the get go immediately um so i often ask the brand saying what are some things that can what are some thing that can get you attention quickly because you don't have any time the first is of course uh, a celebrity helps right if if it's someone that you know you want to continue watching that that obviously helps um especially when you're playing at scale 
even more so because uh, if you use someone popular in an interesting way, it it just works better, I think, because you're used to seeing them a certain way. Um, you can either be visually or orally. Um, you can be interesting audio wise, which is why people often like if you're gonna if you're gonna see an ad fifteen times over, you have to either be visually or interesting through audio, which is often jingle song that sort of stuff. That sort of stuff traditionally has always done well if you if you're catchy. Um, any form of incongruence. You guys understand what incongruence means, which is square peg round hole, right? Incongruence can be created in many different ways. Uska basic formula is that X is expect expected, X is expected, but Y happens. Okay. This is basically incongruence, right? So how I usually think is ki what is the incongruence I can find for this particular, for this particular film? Because if you are congruent, you are boring. You are just like everybody else. Um, so this is very broad. If you ask it in your own way, what can you do in your own way? Right. So that I think is, is, the, is what, what, how I usually work. What is in your own way? You can do anything. Whether you have a celebrity or a situation, you can do anything. So now we have written something for Shark Tank. Where an auntie goes to buy some vegetables. फिर वो सब्जी खरीदते समय बोलती है अरे ये तो इसका तो इसमें तो मैं पूरा तुम्हारा यही खरीद लूँगी तो बोलता है कि एक्चुअली वैल्यूएशन लगा के देखते हैं मेरा साल का टर्नओवर इतना है इसके और 10x का मल्टीपल लगाएगा तो ये तो नहीं होगा तो इसमें इनकॉन्ग्रुएंस क्या है इसमें आप बताओ इसमें इन so ye main sab jagah like this is this goes without saying i apply this to everything because fundamentally in your brain what is what is happening right your brain likes to predict things it's doing that naturally right ki ab kya hoga ab kya hoga iske aage kya hoga aur jab aap aapka brain kuch predict karne ki koshish karta hai ki ye hoga aur wo hota hai to bhi dopamine milta hai isliye main gaane pasand hai da 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 let the beat drop. Like, it's fun, it's fun, it's drop. It's fun, it's fun, it's fun. Right? But you also get pleasantly surprised. That drop didn't come. It's got something else. Then you're like, what's going on? It's fun, it's fun. And X is expected, but Y also happened. So, keeping people engaged is always a combination of giving them a little bit of what they want and a little bit of a surprise. So, you have to somehow manage that quick as in, in as short a time frame. And this applies to everything. It applies to print, it applies to social, it applies to, uh, to TVC, it applies to everything. If you, can make, if you can make people expect X and deliver Y, you have won, quite simply. Uh, that to me is, is the formula. It's <laughs> very <laughs> broad, I'm telling you, I'm telling you basic. But a lot of people, they kind of miss that. Um, and you, and the thing is, brevity is your friend, right? Like the quicker you can make, make someone get into the mood or the milieu or the setting of whatever it is that you're trying to do, um, the quick, the easier it is for you to flip that. So my company's name is One Two Flip. One Two Flip is basically anatomy of a joke. By the way, all content works this way. Jokes are also this only, right? Um, my grandfather had the heart of a lion. And that is why he's not allowed in a zoo anymore. <laughs> right? Expected X, but why happened? Jokes work the same way. Right? Um, all content works the same way. If you can somehow, if you can somehow beat an expectation or deliver on it, right? Uh, delivering on expectation is a more of brand building thing. Right? If you if you deliver, if people expect something and you deliver on it, there's just more likability. That's more a macro view on, on brand building. But on a content view, if you can create expectation and you can beat it, that usually releases dopamine. I hope that answered your question. Next. Tell me. Who's the next line? Yes. How does a new startup uh, approach social media marketing with low budgets to build their brand? <sighs> Interesting. So it's at the risk of repeating myself, right? There are, I like to look at all 
companies imagine if you are own channel actually let, let me rephrase that i don't think budgets are a problem in today's day and age cuz you can make content out of everything um you can make content in your office um some basic fundamentals remain the same which is you just have to be consistent um you just have to keep trying because if you don't take enough shots not enough land as pretty simple um one thing that i often tell founders is if the folks who work in your marketing team if they are creators and or artists who output generally uh that kind of helps just in the hiring process right kyunki ek feedback loop naam ki cheez hoti hai theek hai which is if you are used to creating something presenting it to an audience getting that feedback and then reiterating it isme hi tum bahut seekh jate ho like maine uh even when i was at aib and i used to i used to we used to make videos on youtube for a mahine mein do nikalte the do video hum banate the kyunki that those were artistic videos we used to take time with it but i used to spend a lot of time with the social media team who used to output 6 7 posts a day to 6 6 7 bar din mein tumhe feedback milta raha ki tumne ye bola fir ye aaya as a comedian ek ghante mein mujhe 70 bar aata hai ki main jo bolta hu mujhe feedback mil gaya isliye main open jitna main ho ja raha open mic karunga utna mera set tagda hote rahega so the more you the more you output and you put out in the world you get you get the feedback and then you re- reiterate the better your judgment becomes to agar aapne ek cheez 150 bar kar di na to the 151st time tumko better idea hoga ki ye chalega ki nahi right to ab maine itna youtube itna youtube kiya hai ki ab main roughly predict kar sakta hu ki ye hoga to ye ye bolenge log right so you have to take more shots like that's one of the that's one mistake that most people make is uh they just don't take enough shots so you want to you want to hire creators who are used to who are used to outputting stuff to main to bolta hu ki ab mere jab bhi main agli company banaunga uske andar if i go to hire my marketing team will be full of artists who are driven by some form of artistry and will be full of creators who have either built their own page and scaled it agar kisi bande ne naturally bina kisi pull ke जीरो टू फिफ्टी थाउजेंड लिखे गया तो उसको तो चमकता है कि कुछ कुछ करना आता है इसमें राइट सो आई थिंक द फ्यूचर ऑफ मार्केटिंग इज इफेक्टिवली क्रिएटर्स एंड आर्टिस्ट आई थिंक दोज आर फोक्स विल रूल मार्केटिंग कंसिस्टेंसी आई थिंक इज इज इम्पोर्टेंट अभी इतने में रुकते हैं हम इतने में रुकते हैं नेक्स्ट लाइक how do you ensure the brand's mark brand's uh, communication and positioning goes well uh, when the campaign how do i ensure the brand's communication and positioning yeah. is maintained yeah um i don't uh, <laughs> 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 these things are usually um, determined by the founder which is what they want to what is it that they want to say that is determined by data research etc 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 see anything that you want to communicate will have will have some some root which is an interesting way of um of communicating i don't think it's an either or tumko bolna x hai is x ko bolne ke 15 interesting tarike hai mera kaam hai 15 interesting tarike dhoondna it's not it's not like founder ke bolta hai ki mujhe x bolna hai mai bolta hu ki yaar h bolte na like wo thodi ho raha hai right um that i think is is uh, the usually the problem is saying too much the problem isn't ki tumme tumko maine ek cheez bolne bola aur wohi wohi tumne nahi bola that wo usually problem nahi hota hai problem hota hai reverse ki zyada bol rahe ho um tumhare paas zara time nahi ek cheez mein ek hi cheez bolo aur wo jitne clear spasht tarike se bol sakte ho wohi bolna zaruri hai usually the problem is that which is raita phail jata hai zyada wo control karne mein brevity is your friend in that case ki jitna kam bolo jitna seedha ek hi cheez bolo wo usse उस उससे चीजें ज्यादा इफेक्टिव होती है सो दैट्स व्हाट आई वुड से लाइक टुडे व्हेन आई व्हेन आई सी व्हाट स्टफ यू गाइस हैव डन आई फोरसी कि रायता फैलने वाला है इट्स यूजुअली इट्स यूजुअली अ टिपिकल एमेचरिस मिस्टेक वेयर यू वांट टू से मोर क्योंकि लोग क्रिएटिविटी में बह जाते हैं गाइस इट्स सब कुछ अमेजिंग होता है बट इट्स अ वेरी पॉपुलर कोट व्हिच इज राइटिंग इज रीराइटिंग एक्चुअली द मोर यू द मोर यू एडिट आउट द बेटर इट इज so what we usually do is ki hum pehla hum pehla script likhte hain aur jitna dil mein jo aaya hai sab dal do 
ठीक है पर पिच करने से पहले दो राउंड एडिट के होते हैं मिनिमम इतना कम एंड दिस बाय द वे अप्लाइज इन लाइफ इन जनरल इन मोस्ट सोशल इंटरेक्शन राइट बिकॉज यूजली अ साइन ऑफ डूइंग मोर एंड टेलिंग मोर इज लाइक अ पीपल प्लीज ही इट्स लाइक दो आर रियली श्योर एंड क्लियर अबाउट वॉट दे वॉन्ट दे स्टिक इन द लेन एंड नो जस्ट एग्जैक्टली हाउ मच टू से उससे ना एक सब टेक्स भी बढ़ती है यू द लेसर यू से द मोर पीपल वॉन्ट रीड इन टू वॉट यू से डीपर साइकोलॉजिकल थिंग्स सो याद so i have a question uh, in creative writing it always happens like first cut me ekdam fad bana diya but then second cut third cut me it always boils down to something and loses the element so what do you do do you keep on refining that or you you know go back to the whiteboard sketch it out again and start fresh overthinking to hoti hai objectivity lose to hoti hai in which case um, in which case what really helps me is if you have a band of people whose judgment you trust who have high taste राइट ये अक्सर होता है इनफैक्ट अभी रिसेंटली अभी लेंसकार्ट लेंसकार्ट के एड दिखे थे मैंने तो वी वी वर स्टक विद इट फॉर अबाउट 3 4 वीक्स राइट बाय द एंड ऑफ इट एवरीबॉडी वाज लूजिंग ऑब्जेक्टिविटी बिकॉज़ सम एक 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 लाइन माइक्रो मैनेज और ये और वो उसमें होते हैं बट व्हेन एन ऑडियंस सीज इट दे सीइंग इट फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम राइट सो द फर्स्ट टाइम जो जॉय तुम्हें मिला था जब मैं पहली बार रीडिंग करता हूं मैं सबकी शक्लें देखता हूं कि अच्छा ये हो रहा है इनको मजा आ रहा है इनको मजा आ रहा है You have, you cannot forget that that most people are going to see it for the first time. So you don't want to kill your own baby fully. Uh, Striking that right balance comes with time. The more you do it, the more you start having an idea of when to detach, when when your involvement is necessary, how to work with with a larger team, whose judgment do you trust. So I think if you if you have, I, I on my WhatsApp uh, at any given point I have twenty people I can send something to who all have high high taste, जिनका judgment अच्छा होता है. You want to surround yourself with folks. You want to feedback with folks who have who have good taste, right? Because many people are like that. They like everything. Good feedback is also an art. You know, knowing what to what to tell someone. That they do. But in general, um, yeah. If if you have if you have a list of people, you know, 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 taste which is like mine so if i can trust your judgment right so ek bar if if someone can judge things well or if someone is able to give an idea of hey i think this is what make the product better you don't want to let that person go because often creative collaborators don't leave like i've been working with the same team for 10 years i still go to the same people i still ask them no matter what i'm doing uh kyun ko pata hai ki frank bhi ho sakte hai aur they have an idea of objectivity so you want to you want to be able to The phrase that I use is, मैं किसी कुछ सुनाता हूँ किसी फाउंडर को कि ये मैंने लिखा है फिर फाउंडर को ये बहुत मजा आता है मैंने एक टू पुल इट बैक बाई से लेट स्लीप ऑन इट लेट स्लीप ऑन इट ये कल देखते हैं आइडिया की कमी थोड़ी है जिंदगी में और भी आइडिया सोच लेंगे पर सो के देखो अगले दिन भी उतना ही मजा आ रहा है आई एम अ बिग फैन ऑफ फीडबैक आई फीडबैक आई फीडबैक स्टफ दैट आई एम वर्किंग ऑन विथ ऑल माई फ्रेंड्स ऑल द टाइम हैंग आउट करने में तो कि इट्स नॉट लाइक सुनना मैं तेको एक ad, मैंने एक ऐड लिखा ये सुनते राइट नो वन वॉन्ट्स टू बी लाइक नहीं सुनना है तो इफ इट्स गुड कॉन्टेंट पीपल ऑलवेज वॉन्ट हियर कि स्क्रिप्ट सुना रहे ना तो स्क्रिप्ट सुनाना मतलब क्या ही है इट्स इट्स जस्ट लाइक शेयरिंग अ स्टोरी राइट तो फिर कल मेरे साथ ये हुआ सुनना एक ऐड लिखते सो आई आई फीडबैक हैवीली आई फीडबैक विद ऑल काइंड ऑफ पीपल दैट यूजली गिव्स यू एन आइडिया ऑफ वॉट इज वर्किंग वॉट इज नॉट एंड आई फीडबैक मोस्टली टू फाइंड आउट कि क्या हटाना है इसमें से ये नहीं करना है most times what i've seen is if you have a group of smart people come together and you pitch an idea you can instantly see agar pura room kyunki 25 30 logo ki judgment to off nahi ho sakti agar ye room ye sample size ko maza aa raha hai na to sabko maza aa raha hai for me my personal metric is i need to enjoy it and if my room is enjoying it most people will enjoy it because i'm i'm basic okay to mere ko lagta hai ki main normal insaan ki tarah mujhe maza aa raha hai to sabko maza aayega hi uh So yeah, feedbacking is your friend, man. You gotta feedback wide. You gotta you gotta be able to filter out what. You gotta be able to filter out who's giving you feedback for feedback's sake. You know, what people do is feedback them too. Just to make them make themselves feel like my input is smart. So listen to my thoughts. So you want to be able to see a lot of cool, like my best friends and the most creative friends of mine. Good, good. Not I have nothing to say. Must, must. 
<laughs> like you you achieved what you set out to achieve and that's that's good enough as well zyada bol diya maine basic cheez pe chalo theek hai agla sawal Uh, what do you think separates a good marketeer from a great marketeer? Just experience, I think. Consistency and experience. Um, but इतना इतना मैंने idea भी नहीं है यार ये good great क्या good होना ही बहुत है भाई <laughs> तुम बस good बन जाओ तुम बस दस सालों तक good रहो तुम great बन जाओगे like that distinction is is like the thing with the thing with making content or be, doing marketing is you are the last hit you gave right generally being an artist right you are the last thing that you made abhi abhi bhi har bar jab naya brief aata hai to phatti to hai hi aur fir wapas ki mere profile pe share karna hai bhai is bar humne likha hai it's like you ask you ask anyone yaar you ask uh, beat ritwiz who's just starting off in his career or or beat rehman right which is next album nikalna hota hai to you are the last thing that you made man if the last thing doesn't work you're like I guess I got to get back to the drawing board and do it again. Um, I think yeah, it's uh, marketing. Uh, marketing is nothing short of artistry. Um, you are the last thing that you made, and I think just being good consistently for a long time makes you great. That's about it. But being good only is hard. Just if you become good, boy, you you are insanely valuable, and you should find find a team that values you. Next. Uh, do you think uh, data or consumer insights play a big role in your writing habits? You work on that. How does it come? Yeah, I. That's an interesting question. So for me personally, uh, I rely on the person who's giving the brief to do this part of the job, but I expect them to. Because how we meet, it's like an enemy meet. It's a little bit hard, right? You want to be able to. You want to be able to. flex your creativity on a problem that's actually will move the needle a little bit uh so i expect the person who's briefing to do that i am i am very data friendly i my most used app is youtube studio ki mujhe analytics bahut pasand hai mujhe dekhna bahut pasand hai ki you know kis problem ko hum kaise attack kar rahe so i am a firm firm believer believer in that but once i'm in the realm of where i need to be there i think i'm okay with कि यही चीज हम ऐसे बोल सकते हैं क्या थोड़ा बेंड कर सकते हैं क्या थोड़ा ये कर सकते हैं क्या बिकॉज क्रिएटिविटी इज नॉट अ नंबर एट द एंड ऑफ द डे यू वांट टू बी इन द जोन ऑफ व्हाट्स इफेक्टिव बट यू वांट द जोन टू बी वाइड इनफ दैट यू कैन यू कैन प्ले अराउंड बिकॉज देर इज नो आइडिया दैट इज यू नो इट्स नॉट लाइक आइडियाज आर नॉट लाइक वन प्लस फाइव इक्वल्स टू सिक्स दे नॉट दैट राइट वी आर गोट फाइंड नथिंग दैट एस एज द एक्जैक्ट सेम थिंग दैट यू एक्सपेक्टेड um so i think numbers can take you to the zone of where you should be and once you're there you should let your creativity flex so it's all it's always a it's always a mix of two um it's like saying ki acha dekho mujhe teer maarna hai theek hai i mujhe ek teer maarna hai to teer ko kis direction mein maarna hai wahan pe data is very important kyunki do degree aage piche hota hai na to jitna dur teer jata hai utna further away from the mark you are right so you want to be able to use the number at the angle in which you are you are going to shoot right so you want to be you want to be in the zone of where you need to be you can't there udhar zara discrepancy nahi aa sakti um yeah yeah next okay okay next question ha bolna you talked about cred ads do you think these ads would have worked Had it not been the stars in those ads, no, it wouldn't have. But it was written, keeping in mind, I wouldn't have written those if I knew that we we didn't have access to the people that we had. I wouldn't have written that only. Those wouldn't have worked without without the stars. Why would it? Why would you? Why would you watch uh, him dance? <laughs> you won't. You won't. those were written keeping in mind that this is these are the tools that are available to us how can we create something interesting using that right why so the roast the ai be roast also wouldn't have worked if you didn't have the stars right okay it's me kya that's the that's your playing ground and you want to play you want to play within that so, mm-hmm. so uh, how do you get in the zone where while you're creating these arts uh, i mean what's the mindset what that uh, form of exercise that you do हाँ 
I have a person whose only job is to show me references. Right? I have one person's job is to be like, if I'm writing an ad for a, for a, for a car, I'll be like, just pick the best car ads and just show it to me. I just want to be in the zone and just want to know, okay, what have the best minds thought about already? So for me, I love watching stuff that gets me in the zone. For me, it's like when I sit down to write stand-up, I love watching many different, many different uh, clips that are getting in the zone. But that's my process. It's not necessarily true to ev for everyone. A lot of people are like, I don't want to be derivative. But I'm like, everything, for me personally, I think everything is a derivation of something. Like something has to spark, something has to trigger. Um, if it's not this, then just sitting in a room with other people, it all begins with some sort of an angle or some sort of an insight. If, I, if you're writing something for a car, you just want to be able to be in a room with people and be like, hey, what are these cars? What are you saying? Hey, this is what you've seen in the car. You just want to be, you just want to be in, in that zone. Um, but I, I like a trigger. I like to see something that triggers some, some thought in me. I am an awful solo operator. I can't, I cannot work in isolation. There are a lot of writers who will shut themselves in a room and come out with 15 things. I am not one of those. But there are people who do that as well. Everybody has their, everybody has their own process. I just know that I am solo. I am not a solo. I am not a solo. I am not um, oftentimes it begins with watching a reference of one thing and then that leads into another, then you watch something else and then I'm watching a documentary about caterpillars and then something strikes and it's all, uh, creativity is, is just a bunch of neurons in your head which are making weird patterns, right? When two neurons who haven't spoken to each other start talking to each other, that's when something new happens, right? Um, that is literally, that is literally creativity. That's literally uh, how your brain functions. You need two random patterns to be created between two neurons and then you feel like I have something fresh. Um, that, that is how I operate. I like to watch stuff. Uh, but now how I work is there's a, there's a bunch of folks who work with me. Um, this is now. Now I like to exercise my judgment on a more macro level. Ki if there's a team that comes with me, I get in on the, f they all do the first round of ideation, which is they put down 20 ideas. Ki sab kuch dal diya. Paper ke upar sab kuch. Ye 20 idea hai humare pas. I'll be like, thik hai. Tum sunao. And I'll be like, these five look interesting. Come now, let's, let's work on this is, this is me kuch to andar. Iske andar aise approach kar do kya hoga. Okay, then we round up on, we work for two, three hours. Um, sometimes those two, three hours aren't enough and you feel like we don't have a winner. That these are terms that I use internally. Saying, I don't think we have a winner yet. Um, then you go back and you'll be like, ye angle se socho. Is, isko humne attack nahi kya hai. Uh, sometimes my feedback will be like, Ki, um, I'm not, I'm not visually stimulated enough in any of these. These all seem like, these all feel like visuals that are done. So I like to work with a group of people. Um, and I like to exercise my judgment on macro things. Like I think my core skill is, I know what will slap when it, when it lands. Like I've gotten very good at that. Um, if you present to me five ideas, I've gotten very good at picking key. I think these three will, but that's me personally. So it's a different process. Hota hai. कोई सेट कोई सेट रूल नहीं है कोई सेट रूल नहीं है सब गुलजार साहब अलग लिखते हैं जावेद साहब अलग लिखते हैं लाइक देयर इज नो देयर इज नो सेट रूल बताओ और कुछ है डू यू फोर्स दी ट्रेडिशनल मीडिया लाइक सिबिल बोर्ड्स और न्यूज़पेपर्स और रेडियो टू हैव इन रेलेवेंट एक्सपीरियंस अम नॉट इन द नेक्स्ट 5 इयर्स आई मीन एज़ लॉन्ग एज़ पीपल कंटिन्यू टू गो आउटसाइड बिल बोर्ड्स विल स्टिल बी अराउंड as long as people continue to read newspapers, print will still be around. Um, I don't think, I think the, I'm not worried about there being less modes of advertising. I think there'll be new modes. Who knew that making 9 by 16 videos would be the new advertising, right? Who knew? Um, so there'll be new things to advertise because advertising, advertising much like brokerage is a business that's not going to die. That's going to continue living. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't, in the next five years, it won't happen. If we don't die in the past 10 years, we won't die in the next five years. You know, and that's what I think. And like, what's the one thing which brand managers fail to understand? So one thing that brand managers fail to understand. Interesting. Well, there's no, there's not just one thing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
आई थिंक ब्रांड मैनेजर्स फेल टू रियलाइज दैट रिस्क है तो इश्क है राइट बिकॉज आई थिंक आई मीन इट दैट कम्स फ्रॉम अ फाउंडर मेंटेलिटी राइट यू हैव टू बी विलिंग टू टेक कैलकुलेटेड रिस्क especially the larger the conglomerate the more the more bureaucratic the process the less risk taking ability exists um that i think like it, it's at the heart of it's at the heart of the problem which is being too scared to be able to take risk cuz too much is at too much is at stake which i think is a founder issue to take care of no matter how large the organization if the founder comes and tells you it's okay if you It's okay if it doesn't slap. That's fine. Um, that's it's a big relieving thing. I've worked with so many, so many managers as an influencer, as a as a writer, as a collaborator. Um, and this is the one common problem that I've seen. And the best brand managers I've worked with are folks who are like, I'm an I'm an open book. Let's just I'm this is a collaboration, and it's not a I'm not commissioning work from you. I'm working with you. Uh, those usually are the best brand managers, and those usually have founders who have full faith and trust, and being like it's fine. Um, this is at the heart of heart of most most brand managers, especially ones in larger companies. So, ये बहुत होता है यार. और मेरे को बुरा भी लगता है कि उनको भी तो उनको भी तो at the end of the day deck deck पे डालना पड़ता है और दिखाना पड़ता है कि मैंने मैंने देखो इतना खर्चा किया उससे ये हुआ उससे ये return मिले इतने impression आए वगैरह वगैरह वगैरह. I think the I think folks who are good at predicting second order and third order effects of content and marketing, um, those people tend to take more risks. For example, I've worked with a few brands now, and each time a campaign is successful at an IPL scale, right? It has these second and third order effects. For example, it becomes easier to hire, right? when a great campaign goes out at scale everybody wants to work with you it becomes easier to close close someone the employee nps becomes super high kyunki tumhari sari janta linkedin pe proudly share karti hai ki hamare end se aaya you can't buy these things right to isliye jab koi mere sath you know 20 15 20 lakh rupaye ke ladta hai i'm like you're not you're, you're not understanding the things that can happen uh if you just like you can't these things are priceless You can't put a put a you can't put you can you can't value these things. अगर तुमने दस की हायर कर लिया ना, like I have delivered ten x on what you paid me actually, because these ten people can have effects on your company that otherwise wouldn't wouldn't have had. So I think the great brand managers recognize this. कि internal NPS अगर दस गुना बढ़ जाए ना तो मजा ही आता है. Like I um uh, like like folks at Cred put Cred on their Tinder bio, right? <laughs> You can't buy this. No amount of money, and and Kunal, who, you know, he's so good at at understanding this stuff, gave me full freedom. He, you make stuff that you'd be proud of, and automatically the whole company is is proud of it, right? So great brand managers think like this, and it only happens once you have multiple successes, right? I just did the. I I was telling this to Piyush. We just did the lens card stuff, and I was on LinkedIn, and I had so many lens card employees tag me on LinkedIn. Saying we put this stuff out, really interesting. This is how we were part of it, etc., etc. Um, that feels great to see when you're when the folks inside the company are like, "Hey, cool, da na, what da na?" Say it. That is that is always nice. Yeah. Or कोई thought है तो दबा दो उसे. नहीं पूछ सकते तुम. I'm kidding. Please let let's go on five more minutes. If there's anything else, you guys, please. Just curious on how did you what was it very organically like Kunal called me one day and said can you help me write something uh, for for IPL और देखो आर्टिस्ट की बस यही होती है कि जनता देखे ही इसे मजा आएगा For me, the, this thing was, oh shit! This is gonna, this is gonna go. Uh, this is gonna be, you know, they were one of the sponsors of the IPL. It would be cool if the whole country, like whatever, three hundred million people, are gonna watch this thing. It would be cool. Like that scale was very exciting to me. That everyone would would watch it. Artist ko kya hi chahiye yaar. Artist ko bas chahiye ki koi dekh le kam. Ha aur bas do gram appreciation de de. Usi me, usi me khush jaate hum. 
सो दैट्स हाउ आई वॉज लाइक ओके आई एम नॉट गोन अप्रोच दिस एज मैं एड लिख रहा हूँ आई वॉज लाइक अगर मैं अगर दिन में दस बार कुछ इंसान देखने वाला है तो उसको मजा आना चाहिए देखने में ये चैलेंज था दैट्स हाउ आई दैट्स हाउ आई स्टार्ट राइटिंग वॉट आर समाइव ब्रांड आई वुड लाइक टू राइट फॉर आई डोट आई डोंट थिंक अबाउट दीज थिंग्स एज ब्रांड्स और लाइक माई ट्रिप इन लाइफ इज ये करने में मजा आया कि नहीं like i read the i read the shark tank ads cuz i was like ki shark tank is a it's a cool it's a cool show i like i like the show and i love the impact that the show is having which is everyone's thinking about startups so like this will be fun to make some say something for this i did the lens card stuff cuz i was like i know karan loves he loves uh, he loves doing fun quirky stuff so like it'll be fun to it'll be fun to do something with him um so there i don't look at it as ki koi brand ke sath kaam karna but at some day i would love to write political campaign for You know, for like an election campaign, I would love to do that. Uh, like, I would love to do that kind of that kind of thing, right? I would love to market a film at some some point. I would love to do different different things. There's no, uh, there's no set, there's no set thing. Ki ye karna hai. ऐसा कुछ ऐसा कुछ है नहीं. क्योंकि actual brand work तो boring ही होता है, right? तुमको तुमको मजे चाहिए, क्योंकि ब्रांड के लिए काम है किसको मेलर वेलर किसको लिखना है लाइक नो नो वन वांट्स टू डू दैट सो आई लाइक आई एंजॉय स्केल मजा आएगा अगर कोई प्रधानमंत्री वाला कैंपेन लिख दे तो मजा ही आ जाएगा यार वो स्केल सोच रहे हो तुम मतलब मजा तो आ जाएगा उसमें कुछ किया भी है लाइक लाइक ट्रेडिशनली द बेस्ट एडवर्टाइजिंग फोक्स इन इंडिया वेन अप वर्क डूइंग पोलिटिकल स्टफ ओनली इवेंचुअली तो सबकी ट्रिप वही होती है यार एंड में स्केल में कुछ बन जाए करोड़ों लोगों ने कुछ देख लिया और कुछ उससे कुछ निकल जाए तो मजा मजा आता है यू वॉन्ट राइट स्टफ फॉर स्टोरीज राइट दी एंड डे क्योंकि पैसे के लिए तो कर नहीं रहे <laughs> पैसे के लिए तो धंधा कहाँ करना पड़ता है और बताओ हो गया धन चाय पिए <laughs> चलो तो होपफुली दिस सेशन वॉज यूजफुल टू यू गाइज Did you have fun? Yeah. Did you guys have fun? Yes. It's like do you see like it was like at once. <laughs> like <laughs> choreograph. Paise diye maine sabko. To all the best to you guys. Uh hopefully everything that we spoke about was useful and I'll see you guys in the tank. Thanks. <laughs> nice. Ciao. That was good. All right guys, get to work. <laughs>